Svetlana, the firefly in the room. Hello Plum friends and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. Today is actually a very exciting day for me. Maybe not so much for you but for me this is special because finally our renovations in kitchen are coming to an end. But anyway, I was waiting for this moment, I was working for this moment to come for so long and I put so much effort in it and it's so, it feels so good to finally feel the end coming, you know? What we did, we changed the floors, we changed the walls, the walls actually was with old, you know, Soviet times uh, plates and right now Agnes, my boyfriend, or should I say fiance, <laughs> he renovated all space by himself almost. I, you know, helped there and there, but all in all, it was all of his work and I'm so proud of him. And since the hardest part is down, you know, it's time to decorate and oh guys i wish i could explain for you how much i love decorating oh, i love it <laughs> so what is happening in a couple seconds i will show you how it looks but right now it needs some plants it needs some probably shelving i am thinking about a rug there because to be honest we flippant flippant already ruined very middle of the floors in the kitchen but anyway, we need to hide this thing because we worked on these floors for so long and we're not going to change anything at this moment because money. <laughs> so we, you know, came up with the idea to put a rug on the fail part. But anyway, what is happening? We will go shopping and we'll go shopping to Ikea because we need some more thingies to our apartment. And since Ikea have some nice house plans, I will film for you a plant tour. Probably I'm planning on doing it, but I am not sure how many people will be there on Saturday. It might be a little bit scary and I actually probably will want to leave the Ikea as soon as possible because, you know, it's still Corona happening. So I don't want to be, you know, irresponsible. So I want to just grab everything I need and leave. <laughs> so we'll see about that. This probably might happen, probably not, you know, time will show. But be prepared to see some beautiful plants and to see the end result of my kitchen. Oh, I'm so excited. So it's time to decorate my space. But before that, let me show you how it looks right now. Okay guys, so right now we are in my kitchen. Actually only half of it. Here this part still needs some work. I need to do some cleaning and I will show you it probably next time, you know, because there's still some paint works awaiting and in floor, I mean a lot. But anyway, this is the part where it's finally over and where I will spend most of my free time probably and probably that's where I will film my videos during the winter because our kitchen is the lightest room in our apartment so I'm pretty excited. As you can tell we have a white table and colorful walls, obviously. If you've been for a while on my channel you probably noticed that I don't have any white walls, almost. I mean, 
I am a big fan of colors, I am a colorful, bright person, so whenever I do renovation I try to do something colorful. <laughs> and since our walls won't be that light you now, they are actually, let me show you closer, they are that, you know, uh, it's more like dusty green. Does that make sense? I hope it does. It's dusty green walls. Actually, my boyfriend did, you can tell, this pattern on the wall and I really love it. It's not that plain, boring wall. You know, it's it's a pretty awesome looking ornament, should I tell? What we did, we colored the walls, we colored the radiators because they were red, actually. We renovated the floors. So here is how the floor looks right now. It's you know that light wood that I really love. This is not real wood. This is actually in Lithuania we call it laminatas. I will Google how it's called in English. And where did we fail? Well, over here, if you look close enough, there's already a hole. So since we needed to move that fridge, you know, while putting the floor, that's where the fridge left, you know. A nice memory so we will do something with this wall something with the floors something with the plants obviously my old windowsill is filled with plants but I'll show you a little bit later this part just like that part <laughs> but anyway let's go plant shopping shall we Welcome back. It's Sunday. <laughs> Actually, everything did not went by the plan, but this is nothing new. It's everything by per usual, you know. So today I just want to continue. Actually, when we went to IKEA, there were like a ton of people. It looks like everybody got the salary after, I don't know, half of the year. And you know, everybody just freaked out. So it was a little bit insane in IKEA, so I did not film anything even a planned tour as i promised but guys there was nothing too special to film to be honest i was looking for a taller plants for this corner but i did not find anything interesting so you know there is not not a big loss so long story short i can show you some things that i got for this kitchen i just got some you know kitchen uh, things so this is you know just for the oven and i wanted some uh, simple colors you know nothing too shocking because already my kitchen is pretty you know colorful so i wanted that grayish theme to stay and then as i was talking about the fail in my floors i was looking for a rug but actually i wanted a round rug but there was none of round rugs there wasn't so it was a little bit surprising because i remember seeing some round rugs on ikea but anyway i got this pattern and it looks so cute it was only 10 euros and it's not a you know that fat or chubby rug and that's exactly what I wanted because it's a kitchen you know a lot of stuff happens here some food falls to the ground I have a dog that uh, usually eats here so I wanted something you know um, light that I could just put into the washer you know and clean it whenever I need so this just this will work perfectly so I probably already showed you some clips that I was doing in this kitchen yesterday so as you can tell I have everything here set up. I also put a macrame hanger in here. It's actually two levels macrame hanger. Let me show you. There's one, there is two, right? I'll show you in a bit the full, you know, the full view. But before that, let's finish things up. So right now I have my table in the middle of the kitchen because <laughs> 
actually when we went to the IKEA to buy a shelf for microwave we forgot to get a dimensions of it so when we came to IKEA I called my sister to go and tell me the dimensions of our microwave and of the wall space that we still have you know with this table that you're standing on right now and she gave the wrong dimensions so when we bought this shelving system it you know there was a little bit of a fail because the table right now doesn't fit to the wall so it will be in the middle of the kitchen but at the same time it's a perfect thing because right now i can sit in this cozy corner you know and the table will be you know over here so anyway let's continue because i need to clean the floors finally i need to put the rug and just you know some finishing touches and we're done let's do it guys i finally can tell that this is it oh my gosh it feels unreal and oh i can't believe that finally i sit in the completely done kitchen i mean like 90 percent because we still need to put on some hooks for towels and you know some tiny works that we need to finish up but the huge dark clouds are coming our way so i want to film this asap because soon in here will be so dark and you know you know so anyway bear with me so guys i'm actually so sad that i don't have any before pictures for some reason i just forgot to took some but i have footage from my previous videos that i filmed in the past in my kitchen and here you can see the old floors that we have it it, you know, it wasn't something special and it was ripped in couple places so it wasn't the best shape and also have a couple clips of me talking in the kitchen filming in the kitchen behind me you can see the old tiles actually they were so old they would just fall off just because you're walking by <laughs> so this kitchen really needed a makeover and even though i don't have the very previous pictures I think you can see the vibe and it wasn't in the best shape, let me tell you. And right now I feel so cozy in here, I wanna grab a hot chocolate or a hot coffee and you know, grab a book and sit here and don't walk away anywhere soon, anytime soon. <laughs> but ah, guys, let me just walk you through what we did. So first of all, Agnus repainted this wall, so he took off all of the tiles by himself, he put out a cement in here, he put out the dice, I mean the paint, he, this is his work and this is insane. We also repainted the radiators, they actually were red, I mean this is a weird ch choice of previous owner, but I mean, <laughs> so anyway we painted it in white, we also have this new shelf and it feels so cozy in here i love this hamalonima in here right it just looks perfect for the spot it's just like meant to be in here we have some apples from my aunt <laughs> since we have wooden uh, ceilings we have a lot of wood everywhere around you know so it's pretty woody everywhere you know around so i wanted a floor to be woody as well and not you know just like a simple tiles so the new color is just so bright and it you know it's so much more cozy than the previous floors and also i put a carpet it just immediately gives so much coziness i mean if you have a room that doesn't feel so cozy you just need a carpet man just a carpet it will make a huge difference i have carpets in every single room of mine and actually i know this is not the best for those like me who have uh, trouble with uh, dust because i grow a german shepherd in room apartment and we have lots of carpets and a lot of and lots of dust so it it isn't very healthy for me but 
I'm fighting with it. <laughs> it's so worth it, you know? <laughs> so anyway, we changed the floors. We have beautiful carpet. We put on some, you know, aesthetic thingies in the shelf. I have some baskets that I filled with, you know, potatoes, for example, with my utensils. I have some pasta down there, some syrup for my coffee. And, you know, those cozy tiny things and obviously lots of plants. I mean, some are in macrame, some are on the table. I mean, how do you like this simple thing? I don't know how to call it. So this simple decoration and this uh, terracotta put looks so cozy for me. It just, you know, gives that natural vibes and this beautiful jewel work, it works perfectly. I mean, all of these colors look so, looks so beautiful and I love this part. And I mean, on the table, it looks just perfect. And whenever I need to move it, you know, just to cook something, I just move it away from me and no troubles in here at all. Oh, wait. <laughs> Actually, last thing I need to do, I need to buy a chairs to the kitchen because actually we were in Ikea, but we didn't find anything that, you know, would work in the space. So we still need to work on that. Also, we changed uh, that part, uh, a small shelving unit that also has towels, uh, where to put towels, right? So I loved to use, you know, greenish colors so everything would work together. I put in some uh, see-through jars with pasta and other, with nuts and all of this stuff. I also put some hanging plants, some cebu, uh, some epipremnum pinatum, some potos, and I mean, everything I think just wraps in this perfectly coziness and ah! I feel excited. So last things that I need to do is some curtains probably, chairs and some other small thingies and we are done. Oh my gosh, guys. This is it. This is it, guys. This is it. Oh my gosh, this is it. <laughs> so right now, whoever can come for me, you know, for a coffee date or a tea date, you know, <laughs> you, you are welcome here. Anyway, so this is where I will finish my video right now. I will put a montage for you, the before and after, I mean, whatever I will manage to work on. And, well, I hope to see you in my next videos, as you can tell. I'm trying to put out more videos right now, just like I promised. And some of them will be more plant related, some of them maybe will be not that plant related. I hope you will enjoy all of them. And, guys, thank you so much for watching if you watch till right now oh my gosh man <laughs> you are amazing i love you so much and this means the world for me so thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you enjoy this kind of content don't forget to like this video if you enjoyed this video and comment what which part is your favorite and maybe we have some tips yeah let's see you montage and till the next time bye <laughs> Thank you.